so this is the beginning of the web design journey and if you are a beginner you are so lucky to be here because you know how we teach in here step by step so in this video i'm going to guide you through the process to installing two softwares that is vs code and figma okay we are going to use the figma in designing the web pages and then the vs code to code so stick with me in this video and kindly leave comments concerning issues you might encounter in the process okay now let's jump in all right so we are beginning with the installation of vs code all right so we head to google and say vs code download okay so you can find it here all right so the first link you can click that and over here we have um, windows we have um, mac okay so i'm on windows so i'll just click on windows and the download starts okay but i have it so i'm just going to cancel the download so make sure you complete your download so after downloading just locate this file and then double click to start the installation process so it's saying code is already installed on the system for all users we recommend first on installing the blah 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 do you want to continue installation so for the sake of this i will just continue with the installation and you have to accept the agreement go to next and then this this one is default okay so you can click next and no this will shortcuts and all of that okay so you can say don't create shortcuts whatever and over here um register what was the same select additional tax okay so creating a desktop icon you can check that open with code action you can click this add open code action or click this so you can check all of them okay and then go to next and right now all you need to do is click install i have it already i'm not going to install all right so yes 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 i want to exit setup so that is that okay so after installation we are going to launch uh the vs code all right so there's the welcome page if you are a beginner and this is your first time opening vs code okay so with this one let's go to desktop okay you are going to desktop and kindly subscribe thank you so right click and create a new folder on desktop and you can name it let's say web design okay web with cook i'm just naming mine so you can add yours so you create a new folder over here on desktop as a graphic designer you've come across motion flyers if not this is what i mean So what you are seeing right here were static flyers brought to life in adobe after effects and i'm sure you want to know more about this hi there i'm emmanuel and welcome to the ultimate flyer animation crash course with cool graphics from 2d to 3d flyer animation in adobe after effects and then come to vs code up here go to file and then open folder okay so click open folder locate the folder that you created on desktop so i'm just going down and i have web with cook all right so i have a new folder good so i can delete this guy or close that and this is the folder okay the open the um, web with cook right now over here you see new file this is new file and this is new folder if you want to create a new folder a sub folder okay good or simply come to file and then new file over here good so let's click this new file and let's give it a name so you can say index.html okay i think you've heard the sound saying kindly subscribe okay so index.html hit enter 
all right so we have our first html document okay so with this uh it is saved in the folder in order not to confuse anybody simply type hello world okay hello world all right and control s to save all right so on this index.html up here all right right click on it and you will see copy path so we've copied the path now open chrome whatever browser you're using new tab and then over here just paste whatever you copied okay what we copied there paste and hit enter we have a new web page blank but we got the hello world that we typed in there over here so if i change this okay to subscribe else your pc will spoil okay. <laughs> your pc will crash and i mean it so if we type something like this are you typing the same thing hit ctrl s to save we come over here and then we refresh we have subscribe else your pc will crash so uh, later on we will install a uh, live server okay so that it will automatically refresh itself so that is that now if you are here that means we we, we we've successfully installed vs code and we are good to go to figma okay so let's go and try installing figma someone has sent another message they are not subscribing so let's type figma download okay and let's go first link figma downloads how many downloads do you have desktop app fonts install no you're not install. so desktop app for windows if you are on mac go for that yo continue as i'll continue later please so desktop app for windows and it is downloading over here okay i will stop it because i got it so after downloading same process you go to your downloads locate wherever whatever was downloaded and you install it just a normal routine i don't have the executable file so but i got it here okay so i'm going to launch it so uh figma open and i think if yours is fresh okay if yours is fresh you might be seeing something weird because uh you will have to sign up on the browser or something so if if you have accounts already you have an account already you can log in with brow in with browser okay so it will take you to the browser then you log in over there if no accounts create one so if you create if you click create so i think i've forgotten my uh account or whatever <laughs> password or something because i normally design in adobe xd okay you know i'm adobe boy so but anyways you can continue with google all right so let's continue with google if they tell me um i've signed up with this gmail then uh i'm good so this let's choose this and i'll go to continue okay so log in as ochichukujich that's a nice name right <laughs> open the desktop app okay so it's saying always allow figma to open links types associated with app good granted open figma so right now we are back in the figma app okay and we can maximize things up here but remember you can log in on the app with mobile um with network okay then you go offline okay so we are here and i have a couple of uh works that i did okay and you should see your accounts over here and if you see that and you got these stuff templates over here then that means you are through okay so if you have any questions just join the whatsapp link okay and let me know your questions and we talk about that over there and no figma tutorial on this channel so we are moving to this channel right here that is where the basics of html css the coding and then the web design on figma will take place so we are all going there to subscribe to this channel if you want to be in the web design class all right so the link to that channel is in the description and kindly check that out and there will be a session over here called design 
or code like a designer you will design a web page in adobe illustrator and then you code it that one is not for beginners okay for those who have knowledge in it already all right but for figma and the from beginning we are all moving to this channel thank you i'm out peace